Welcome to Sports Jokes with Chris Burns. I'm him. We start with something that's kind of a sport. Joey Chestnut ate 68 hot dogs in 10 minutes at the Nathan's Hot Dog Eating Contest on the 4th of July, winning the contest and disappointing his parents for the sixth year in a row. That's, um, that's a great picture, but that's not of Joey Chestnut's parents. That's actually a picture of my parents after finding out they have an adult bald son who still makes YouTube videos. In NBA news this week, the New Jersey Nets signed Chris Humphreys to a two-year deal, although both parties secretly agreed that he'd be released after just 72 days. In this week's bald white guy report, Jason Kidd, who I admit is probably only half white, was arrested last week on suspicion of driving under the influence. This was just days after the New York Knicks signed the 39-year-old on suspicion that he's not too old to play basketball. Ah, that's a fun one. Knicks management sees Jason Kidd serving as a mentor to their other free agent acquisition, Raymond Felton, who Kidd believes has enough talent to get his own DUI in six months or less. Cedar Point, one of America's largest amusement parks, says revenue is up 5% this year, despite being located in a town called Sandusky, Ohio. Although, that could change once people find out who's in this Snoopy suit. Famous virgin Lolo Jones is... What? She's a Olympic hurdler, Lolo Jones. Here's a graph that shows how many people in America know that Lolo Jones is a virgin compared to how many people know that she's an Olympic hurdler. Obviously, I wasn't the only one that made that mistake. NFL training camp kicks off this week, marking an end to what law enforcement officials call their busy season. 29 NFL players have been arrested since the Super Bowl, leaving the league just seven arrests short of its... Quota. There were tons of player moves this offseason as Mario Williams went to the Bills, Peyton Manning went to the Broncos, and Terrell Owens went on Dr. Phil. Seriously, he was on Dr. Phil. The 49ers were very active, picking up a bunch of new receivers. When Alex Smith got to minicamp, he said that throwing to his new receivers was like being a kid on Christmas. His receivers said that catching passes from Alex Smith were like being a Jewish kid on Christmas. And finally, many thought the Jets were the obvious pick for the HBO Hard Knock series this year, but they ended up losing out to the Dolphins. Doesn't have to be a total loss for the Jets, though, as long as Antonio Cromartie says yes to this TV show idea I have for him. Well, that's it from, for Sports Jokes with Chris Burns. Thanks for checking in this week. You can catch me on Twitter uh, at thefanhub.com.